All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So, literally, it, it's been a day. It's been 24 hours for you guys, but it's literally been a couple seconds. It was literally, like, recording with Quibola, stop, end the video, save the video to Camtasia. Didn't even render it. Come back, duel with Brennan Gibbs. You know, I'm trying to double up. I want to be done with my recording for both, you know, Wednesday videos and Thursday videos so I can just spend all of Wednesday just playing some Xenoverse, and then I'll study. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, Burning Abyss Day. So let's do this. This hand's actually okay. It's not terrible. Pretty good, actually. Yeah. I have some plays. I, I, I personally, I like Crane Crane. Crane Crane's easy access to, you know, Dante. And it's, I can actually play it when uh, Dark Law is on the field. Because, you know, once Dark Law's on the field, you know, all my non-Burning Abyss monsters die. But, you know, Tour God and Crane Crane are kind of locking it down. I don't play um that other one. Who the fuck is this? Okay. <laughs> I was like, who the fuck is this? I've never seen this this black wing guy before. There's a lot of them I haven't seen, I guess. But uh, my opponent just quit. I didn't get to do anything. You don't even know what deck I was using. <sighs> All right. We're back. All right. Let's actually get some duels. If we're going to double up and I'm going to, you know, duel twice as much as I would usually regularly duel. And let's at least do it right. This hand is good. Good. Actually, I was about to say not good, but it's fucking great. You summon from the deck, right? Oh my god, this hand's fucking busted then. Alright, activate you. Summon you. Almost summon you. Going to Dante. This hand's fucking busty. Smell. Detach you. Smell me three. One, two, three. Yes. Who else? Kagna? Sure. Kagna, drop me a good evil in the Burning Abyss, and you go ahead and summon me a Sir. Set that. Set the Karma Cut, which I can play. Set the Fire Lake, which I opened up with. Fucking busted. Whew! That was a beautiful hand. That was a beautiful hand. That, that hand brought a freaking... made a tear run down my cheek with its beauty. Wow, okay. Well, more of this deck. Alright. More fluffs. Can't get enough fluff. We, we, we dueled, didn't we duel with enough fluffs not yesterday? Which is like a couple minutes after that. It's everybody on here using freaking... It's the same day, same time frame. Like, not even... There's not a huge time difference. Yet, here we are. It sucks that there's a time gap in between that sheep. A sheep is a pretty good card. It's just a you know, a gap in between the time that it's being played and all. Um, I could search for Fire Lake. So I'd rather actually get back Graph. I don't like that car going back and you getting the plot. I don't like the, you, you know, from yesterday, I don't like this doggy going back to the hand. This doggy's good, you know, he, he searches, you know, no, get rid of him. You're not going to go ahead and return back to the hand with sheep and then summon the edge and says that you just search. Like, no, 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 no. I, you know, I don't know this deck 100%, but I know some of its plays and that's not one of them that I'm interested in seeing. <laughs> Alright, well, it goes Teddy Bear, go ahead and get your little toy vendor, toy vendor. You like discard a card, draw, and if it's not anything, you pitch it. Well, there. You negged. So, um, thanks for that. No, I'm not saying that fluffles aren't good, but it's just pretty, it's pretty evident that, you know, compared to the top, top decks here. Pitch you. Go ahead and get me a fucking fire leak again. You'll go off. Hope you got like a vanity or something. We'll go ahead and send Skarm. Set the manatees. Set the fire lake. And pass. And I'm gonna fire like you again. Like. Fucking just. Fucking, this deck is like fucking big old, just big titties right now. I'm just fucking just sacking the shit out of my opponent. Get 
just sitting here, just sacking. <laughs> God. Yeah. Beat the crap out of you with Klebola. I'll beat the crap out of you with Burning Abyss. I don't like the idea of him, you know, getting his toy vendor. You know, I definitely don't. Get my fire light, because I'm about to search for tour guide. Like I said, I dueled, I dueled against Burning Abyss in a tournament at freaking, uh, was it YCS Anaheim? And this is exactly what he fucking did to me. This is exactly what he fucking did to me. He just fucking laid me down. <laughs> And he went to town on my ass. That's like what I'm doing right now. Just kicking the living sh shit out of my opponent. Oh, yeah. I need Skarm to activate. To grab me a tour guide. This tour guide is, of course, a one-card freaking uh, firelight set up. Look at this. I'm, just, I'm, I'm in complete control of this duel. Complete control. You can't, I can't be more in control of this duel. Tour guide, tour guide, summon, uh, yeah, summon, sir, go ahead, go back into Dante, mill three, like, I don't even know, I'm surprised my opponent here hasn't even quit with just how fucking irritating I've been this entire duel, no, yes, graph, Go ahead, come back. Summon me, sir. I said come back. I meant summon me from my uh, deck. There it goes. 4,100. So there goes half your life points. And I got a Fire Lake. And I got a these And I got Karma Cut. Like, and I got Skarm. And I got Farfa. Like, shake my goddamn hand because this is pretty much it, dude. I mean, you don't have to. I mean, you can. Shit. I sacked the loon shitty. I'm, I apologize. I opened up stupid, and I've just been continuing with this fucking hype train. So he's done summon his puppy. Puppy's gonna search. Then... And so it begins. What begins? This is the end. Ooh, what does he do? Cards them something you can send one fuckful from your hand to the graveyard. Draw two cards and place one card from your hand. I mean, okay, the card's not that bad. I'd say the only problem is, is that whatever you put on top of the deck, you know, but at least you get to see it, you know, you can put it at the top of the bottom of the deck. You know, this card's pretty good. This card's pretty good. You play it. You pitch, you draw two, so you zero out. Yeah, you zero out, but still, it's pretty good. Been able to see two cards ahead and draw one. You know, at the cost of one of your Fluffle Monsters, and you have your Fluffle Miracle Fusion. Yeah. Oh, so easy. Dark Fusion. I don't... Uh, it's in the closet. In the closet. Um. Nah. You can quit now. Yeah. All right, we'll get another duel in. Be right back. All right, we're back. No. Yeah. God, burning abyss are so strong. If I would, if I would run any, any, competitive deck, like any competitive deck. It would definitely have to be uh, Burning Abyss. Yeah. Burning Abyss are just so strong. They float. They they plus. They just... God, they're so fucking good. So fucking good. This hand's actually not terrible. It's not... Probably wondering why I normal summoned this Skarm. And the reason why I normal summoned this Skarm and didn't, you know, set it is because uh, this has to be targeted face up. The only problem is I gotta fucking play this, pitch this, and then turn this into Dark Law, and then... <sighs> what are we waiting for? You wanna fucking Valor it, or you wanna fucking Maxi? Like, I'm not planning on special summoning. 
Bam. Yeah, I wish I would have opened up with a different... If I would have opened up with one different Burning Abyss, uh, my plays would have been a little bit different. I said there is nothing wrong with dealing with the Dark Wall. So you're just, just going to set a monster. Set one back row. Set two back row. So he's afraid of the Skarm? I'm not even going to transform this turn then. If you're not going to, if you're not going to commit to anything, then I'm not going to commit to anything. We'll take Dual Slow. Might be able to draw a different Burning Abyss. Alright. Hmm. I could summon Skarm X, normal summon Skarm XC into Dante. Yeah, that seems like a fine idea. Yeah, and if he wants to, if he wants to completely fuck me up right now, I mean, I'm still okay. I think of like torrental and fucking uh, macro. This would be cards that won. I uh, could Alucard, but I would rather. I'd rather Dante. I'd, <laughs> I'd rather Dante. Dante is the man. Sell him warning? No. Alright. All right, Dante, detach my Skarm, one of the Skarms, mail me three. One, two, three. Wow. Fucking beautiful mills. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Beautiful fucking mills, hello? Skarm, do you have to be in the graveyard to resolve your effect? Graph, do you have to be in the graveyard to resolve your effect? I don't know. I'm trying to think. I don't think so. No, I don't. Okay. Um, think about Cagna. Rubric? Cagna. Has BA slash Light Swarms happened yet? Mm, uh, it's not really a thing. <sighs> oh, I said now really a thing. Not really a thing. Anything since, uh, since you. Uh, I'm gonna have BA on the field for BA monsters. That's the problem, you know? If you could have, if you could have, like, other monsters on the field with including with the Burning Abyss, then, yeah, sure, you know, that would probably be a thing. That would, that would probably be a thing, you know? Uh, Burning Abyss, uh, I'm trying to think if I want to mill more. Burning Abyss Light Swarms, that would probably be a thing, you know. The Light Swarm Draw Engine, Mill Engine, Plusing, probably. But, you know. I was thinking about my, not, not making another Dante, but then I thought, you know, I'm going to make another Dante because I want to mill Cagna. I want to send Cagna. Yeah. So, we'll just go ahead and shape back up. Sent another Skarm. All right. Sure. Oh, I sent Farfa too? Does Farfa say banish a face-up monster or a monster? Hold on, be back. Never mind, Farfa says banish a monster to the end phase, so you can go away to the end phase. Get off my field and I'm gonna hit you for 5,000 unless you have back row. Right, yep, leave my presence and we'll go ahead and send a good and evil. I know, wow. Well. But hey, Burning Abyss, like I said, if there was any competitive deck, like if I was like straight up, I want to be in the competitive circuit, I want to, you know, I want to try, and I got and I got money, go ahead, yeah, Burning Abyss, definitely, definitely. I don't even understand how people even think Necro is the strongest deck. When you look at Burning Abyss, look at this fucking deck. This deck is fucking stupid. Fucking, all Necros are is just a searchy deck. They're just a, the, the searchy ritual deck. That's all they are. Fucking Burning Abyss here. Like, look at the fucking plays I am fucking doing. End phase, you come back. Hell yeah, I'll get my Skarm search. I only get one though. It's here. Um, give me Sir, because I'm probably gonna pitch with Phoenix Wing Wind Blast. Sucks that I can't mass change second one of them, huh? Because <laughs> they, you know, it has to be a monster with a level. And I am a rank.
<gasps> wow. Really? Like, dude. It's not smart, man. So we'll go to attack. Who do you who had, who do you have on you? Scarm. All right, and who do you have on you? Graph. Wow. Fucking just beautiful. <laughs> Brings a tear to my eye. <laughs> All right. Well, I am fishing for a farfa. We still have two more farfas in the deck. So one, two, three. Nope, didn't get a farfa. That's fine though. All right, let's try you. Fishing for a farfa. One, two, three. Damn, still didn't get a farfa. I really wanted to banish that monster. I mean, we're still good. Don't even have any burning abyss monsters left in my deck. Like shit, at this point, I guess. I mean, Graph is trying to go off, so at least we have something. Now tell me, do I have any rubrics left? Because I like rubric. Rubric. All right. Wait, I didn't need rubric. I could have just went fucking crane crane. Hello. Oh, dumb. That was dumb. Normal summon. You're gonna die, which is fine. But you see, when you die, I bring you back. Like I said, I think fucking Crane Crane is fan fucking tastic in this deck. More Dantes. More, uh. That's fine. Uh, more Dantes. More, uh. Being able, it's a it, it, easier to summon rubric. I think I think this second shit's fucking beautiful. Then the one burning this pitch. Fucking veiled me like okay. See you. Um. I don't have fire like yet. Do I want sir? No. I could have got far for fuck. Ah, fucking missing play, and I could have got I could have summoned far for far for to die, and I would have banished that monster, and then won this door. I mean, now nah, I can't even end the door. You know what? It's gonna fuck around. Kind of pisses me off now. I should have summoned Farfa. I was like, no, I don't want Zing. Yeah, I do. I want Farfa. I want to summon Farfa. Farfa, banish that. Oh, great. See, yeah. Fucking should have been Farfa. Fuck. This card is going to go to level. It's level one. Yeah, well, I'm What does this do? We're gonna play any number of monster cards in your graveyard to destroy one face up monster on the field whose level is equal to us and blah 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 blah. Ooh. Oh, I'm gonna be taking some damage. I don't wanna do this. But I will, just so I don't fucking run into that fucking shit. Really wish I would have banished. Alright. Ah, I fucked up. Farfa. Farfa. I should have summoned Farfa. Farfa summoned. Gone. You know, I, mean, I wouldn't even have to deal with this, but Carmen, the van needs to come. Then, you run away I pitched the tour guys because I had the Fire Lake, so, you know, if you had done anything, I had the two Dante's Fire Lake go, ah, oh, melt, and then, you know, I would have got back, got back, so. We're still okay. We're still okay. You know. But, I'd veil around my crane crane. It's like, oh, okay. Well, that kind of ruined my plan because I was totally going to go crane crane, summon back root break, go, so go summon Virgil. Virgil will go ahead, pitch, and spin, and then. So. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call it episode. So. <laughs> oh my god. Doubling it up. Yep. So, anyway. I will see you guys 
from a while now. I won't see you guys till Friday. Hello, because <laughs> uh, I'm recording. I recorded for Wednesday. Recorded for Thursday. It's Tuesday. I won't see you guys till Friday. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you on Friday. Not tomorrow. Not for me anyway. I will see you guys on Friday using volcanics. Hopefully, I got the deck right. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.